So what's the name of this trail, baby? Donner Summit. Donner Pass Summit. Tunnel Trail. Yeah. Donner Pass Summit. Tunnel Trail. So when you get to the trailhead, I believe this is Summit House, uh, the area in which we parked. There is going to be a small trail on the left-hand side, and you're just going to have to start off on that one. Go towards the lake, and you'll start to see trails heading down towards where the old tracks used to be in the tunnels. So let's go, and let's check this out. They're really pretty. Yeah, that's really pretty. Okay. I hope that's it. Those look like tunnels. Mm -hmm. yeah, just gotta figure out a way to get down. It's just awesome here, all of the beautiful landscape, and then you see the tunnels and a whole bunch of graffiti, and just keep in mind, some of this graffiti is not kid friendly, but it is pretty cool, and it's the reason why we came here. Let's head down the mountain, and let's check out the tunnels. Some of the tunnels are quite dark. You're definitely gonna need a flashlight. And when you get to certain areas, there are a bunch of bats that live in the area, which is actually pretty freaky at first. You'll see them flying around. They usually live in the cracks uh, in the concrete areas more than in these uh, rock areas. But you'll hear them, they're chirping along. There is a bunch of cool art in here. Unfortunately, some of the people tagged over a lot of cool art. I wish they wouldn't do that, but you'll still see a lot of cool stuff, especially near the end of this video. I do have a really cool mural that was painted. So wait till the end of this video and you can see it. Back to the top. This is one of my wife's favorites. It's a giraffe. Periodically they have roll-up doors that are open. And you can go to these open areas and see these vista points and look down upon Donner Lake. 
which is really an awesome view. It's really beautiful and really cool to come up here. The weather today was in the 80s and just perfect. like this mural. It had uh, some of the Simpsons in it. It was pretty cool, especially the uh, Maggie. I thought this one was pretty cool. This was another one of my favorites. This crazy psycho um, skeleton was kind of cool. And looks like the artist only did it in 2015, if that's his signature. Can't really tell. Like I said, a lot of people draw over there or you know, paint over each other's artwork. So I can't tell if this is all one mural or if it's multiple murals. You'll read a lot of quotes here. This one is, open your eyes, stop looking at your phone. Ooh. If you listen close, you can hear the bats squeaking. Lots of bats. When you see this open area here, you're coming to one of the last tunnels in the trip here. last tunnel once we get through this you won't have much more to go and it's about two miles to go from the first tunnel to the last tunnel I see light at the end of the tunnel but it was dark as hell in here bring a good flashlight uh, why I didn't expect now we're outside of the tunnels and we're pretty much finished with the tunnels we didn't really know there is no signage out here telling you go left go right you're coming to the last tunnel or anything so once you see a big dirt road and a switchback you're pretty much done with the tunnels but it is really pretty out here you can get a nice shot of the lake and if you go a little bit farther up you'll get to the actual real railroad tracks and uh, that means you went about a mile past the tunnel. And that's what we actually did. We went a mile past the tunnels and uh, we ended up having lunch out there and then turned around and went back the way we came. Donner Lake in Truckee, California. So I have no idea what this is a mural of or who painted it, but I thought it was really cool, um, especially the portraits on either side. I thought that they were done really well. I have no idea if they spray painted them or what they really used as far as a medium, but it came out nice. So now we are probably three quarters of the way back and we're just going to go through a couple more tunnels and then we're going to go have ourselves 
a nice surprise. Summit House, and it has hot dogs and Polish dogs and really good beer, and it's cold, and it also has some ice cream. So we sat down, had ourselves a drink after a great hike. The Donner Lake Summit Tunnel Trail hike. Mouthful. Awesome area. It's really fun for couples. Definitely bring a flashlight if you want to be able to see stuff. That's my review. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you really like this video or leave a comment or a like. Later.